Here we go with how to retarget on Facebook. So for those of you that don't know what retargeting is, it's basically just sending an advertisement to someone that's already visited or consumed some of your content. So if they went to your website, you can retarget them based on them having visited your website. If they watched one of your videos on Facebook, you can retarget them based on them having watched your video and several other things. But that's the main idea is someone who has visited or consumed a piece of your content, you can retarget them and send an ad to them. And this can obviously be very effective, um, sometimes not, right? If someone saw a piece of your content, visited your website and just didn't like any of it and left, fine. But there are lots of people who will show up at your website or watch a piece of your content, whatever, and maybe just the timing wasn't right or they got distracted or millions of reasons. So what you can do is just retarget them, send them another ad, and then now that you have a second chance at them, you know, buying whatever you're selling. Can't believe I've left that on there all this time. All right, so here's how to set up retargeting. Inside of your business manager, come up here, click for the drop down under assets, click on audiences, and that'll bring you to this page here. And then you just want to click on create audience and custom audience, you want to click there. And then we want to click on this engagement section down here where it says create a list of people who engage with your content on Facebook or Instagram. Okay, so like I said, like I explained, people who've already engaged with some of your content, we're gonna retarget them. So click on engagement, and then now you have these different options that you can choose from here. So the top one here is the video option. So anybody who's viewed your video, you can retarget them lead form someone who has filled out a lead form or who interacted with your lead form you know, even if they didn't fill it out you can retarget them full screen experience anyone who clicked your video to full screen facebook page anyone who's interacted with your facebook page and so on okay so for this one i'm going to show you video um and you know go explore all of these but for this video i'm just going to show you how to do video and so you just give that a click and then right here under engagement you need to choose uh, one of these options. So you can choose people who viewed at least three seconds of the video, 10 seconds of your video, 25% of it, 50, 75, or 95% of it. And so, you know, maybe someone who viewed 10 seconds of your video was interested, but for whatever reason lost interest or got distracted. So maybe you wanna choose that. So let's choose to retarget people who viewed at least 10 seconds of the video. And then you've got to choose the video that you're going to base this retargeting off of. So click choose videos, and then you've got to select one of your previous videos. So I'm just going to do that one right there. And then in the past 365 days, if you hover over the eye, you can see the maximum time is 365 days. Uh, you know, you can change that as needed or as you want. I think it's smart to give it as much data and information as possible. So I leave it set to the max, which is 365 days. Audience name, uh, let's name it 10 seconds of, I don't, the example video. I'm not even gonna, yeah, we'll just do that. And then create audience, give that a click. It says, thanks for creating custom audience. It will take up to 30 minutes for your audience to be ready to use. Okay, great, click next. And we can exit out of this now. So now you can see right here that we've created this audience of everybody that viewed 10 seconds of our example video. All right, so now what you do is you go create an ad. So ads manager, set up ad account. I'm just gonna blow through this here, get to the actual ad creation part or the targeting part, I should say. And then you come right here under custom audiences and select that audience that we just created for retargeting purposes. So click that custom audience. Now you may or may not want to, you know, narrow it even further from there, but that's totally up to you. But then from there you just, you know, finish your targeting and create your ad as normal and send the ad to this re custom retargeting audience that we just created. And you can do that exact same thing if we come back here to audiences. Uh, create custom audience. We're doing engagement. 
video. Again, remember you can choose all of these different ones. I'm going to go back and I'll show you lead gen, uh, which, let's see. Yeah, so lead gen is actually tomorrow's video. So subscribe, enable notifications, watch tomorrow's video on lead generation. It's really cool. Facebook added a new tool like you can do lead gen just inside of the ad itself. You can collect email addresses or whatever information you're trying to collect, which is super dope. Um, but here I'll just show you how to do this. So we've got include people who meet and then you select this right here, any or all of the following. Okay, so anyone who opened the form, or you can choose people who opened but didn't submit, or people who opened and submitted. So there you have the different options of people you can select. And then the maximum time for the lead gen retargeting is 90 days. And then you need to select whatever Facebook page this is associated with, because when you run lead gen, you have to also have that connected to a Facebook page. So just make sure you're, you're using the same Facebook page. Uh, give it a name. Oh yeah, we need to add in the select specified form. So right here you need to select the form that you created. I haven't previously created a lead gen form in this account, so nothing's showing up. But this is where you'll need to select whichever lead form you're retargeting based off of. And then just click create audience and then exact same thing as I just showed you. It'll show up right here. And then you just go to your ads manager, create an ad and select the audience that we just created off of lead gen as your custom audience create your ad and send it to them. That's it.